Let's spend a minute looking at exactly the same example that we saw before, but making small changes to it so that we understand why it is the way it is and what happens when we make changes. So here's the completed solution from last time. I've removed a few extra lines. This is all you'd need to write down if you were, for instance, taking an exam. Now, what happens if we just get rid of the non-local bear statement? Well, then bear will be assigned as the local assignment here. But we refer to bear before it's assigned. Remember, there's this quirk in Python where you can't have local assignment and a non-local name lookup in the body of the same function. So because this is here, this call to bear of Burke will fail because it will claim that it cannot find the name bear. You might wonder why not? It's right there. Well, the problem is that it's Python has scanned the body of this function, realized that bear is assigned locally and therefore is going to be a local name and the non-local name is not available as a result. So we can fix this no problem. We'll just change bear here to something else. Now this bear will refer to whatever bear is set at the beginning, which is the absolute value. So we won't get an error anymore, but something else bad will happen. Every time we go bear Burke, we're going to get the absolute value of two. And then we're going to go through and call Cal Burke again and get the absolute value of two. And this will lead to a never ending recursion because bear will never change. So the only reason this example worked in the first place is that even though we called the same function cal2 and then cal2 again, there had been a change. The non-local assignment had redefined what bear was, which meant that the second time that we got to this line, a different effect occurred. But that won't be the case if we make this change. So we can verify these two claims that I made. Well, we can visualize the execution of the original example. And there it is with a slightly different layout than the one I drew. Of course, if you want to print out what all those nested tuples look like in Python, we can go to the end and see that this two with three one as its second element ends up getting printed out like that. Now I claimed that if I delete this, I'm going to get an error and let's watch that happen. So we call Cal and as soon as we get to the line, bear Burke, even though bear is in the current environment, since we have local assignment later on, that gives us an error, local variable bear reference before assignment. If instead we change this to bore so that we don't have that problem anymore, and then we visualize execution again, it says it stopped after 300 steps to prevent a possible infinite loop. And this is not just a possible infinite loop. This is definitely an infinite loop because every time we call Cal, we create a new Lambda function, but we never use it because it doesn't change bear. And so it kind of just runs forever and forever in the online Python tutor is 300 steps and then it stops. 